Basketball on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson, alongside Grant Hill, Steve Smith, and Allie LaForce. We've got the San Antonio Spurs and the Miami Heat. And a look at the starters for the Spurs. Wade misses. That was the best he could do. Just fade a little bit, try and get a clean look, but the defense was right on him. Leonard passes to Parker. Pass to Splitter. Lots of room. And he gets the friendly roll as that one goes. The veteran eyes see all. Frenchie with the tremendous look to make that play happen. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. And the Heat making a change here. Allen's checked in. And it's Miami's ball. To the paint. Here's Wade. The rebound by Duncan. Outside, Green. Here's Parker. Here's Duncan. And that one's good with extra effort on the glass. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now, here is James. And the lamp is good off the glass. Assertive play from LeBron in the paint. Winning himself a high percentage look. And just around a minute and a half into this first quarter. Pass to Green. Fires from deep. And it's Miami with a rebound. And yeah, that old adage about being too wide open, not a thing. He just missed it. For three, Allen knocks down the triple. You know, he's had a handful of seasons in the top ten in assists. Wade is a gifted passer. Allen against Parker. Pass to Green. Here's Duncan. Leonard on the wing. Check by James. Leonard, good. Boy in the paint, Kawhi Tan right through the D. Just pushing his way to a shot. Fantastic replay we just saw of the mobile one drive. Yeah, and in close games like this one, B.A., you need toughness. Guys who will run to the fight and get after it. A chance to get a quick injury report. Thanks, I just talked with Miami's head athletic trainer, and he was relieved that the shoulder's only bruised. Looks like he avoided what could have been a very serious injury. All right, Allie, thank you. Sadly, that's not the news fans were hoping for, guys. Definitely not. Seems like he's got a long, tough road ahead of him. I mean, a devastating blow, to say the least. So it's San Antonio now. Following the bucket by the Heat, Duncan. Parker against Allen. Parker passes to Green. Driving inside. No luck on that one. And Miami will go the other way with it. James, outside. Pass to Allen. Here's Wade. And here's James. Down to five on the shot clock. Inside. Here's Bosch. Good. Trying to stop LeBron in the pick and roll. With his versatility, it's a no-win situation. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Parker against Allen. Parker inside. There's the block. And as it goes out of bounds, San Antonio will keep possession. And now it's time to take another view of that huge swat. I mean, letting them know up front that he's on the hunt tonight and eager to knock away shots. I love it. The Spurs making a switch here. Manu Ginobili.
Tries a three off the inbound. And it's Miami with a rebound. Here's Wade. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Now, here is James. Four on the clock. To the middle. The steal! Outside, Green. Pass to Parker. Leonard outside. Now Parker. Shot to end the cold streak. The rebound by Boss. The heap of the lead. No question, this offense has some firepower. <laughs> and they're looking very confident in all that they're doing right now. James, left side. You see the physicality of LeBron. Doesn't fear absorbing contact on the way up. First team foul. Now at the line, LeBron James. Two. Free throw, good from James. You know, at this point, I think we can call LeBron James timeless. The seasons change, but his game stays strong. He's a rare talent. We got this, we got this. And both good from the line that time. San Antonio trailing here. to Leonard. Here's Duncan. Drops in the layup for two. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Here's Chalmers. There's 42 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Clock at six. Here's James. Cashes in the 12-footer. James has got his third basket on the night right there. Beautiful timing on the part of LeBron. Powerful move off the pick and roll. Pass to Duncan. Down low. The shot's good. Six points for him. Got it in deep, and that's how you do it. James against Leonard. Shots good by James. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Parker outside. Here's Duncan. From the right block. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Back the line for the Spurs. Tim Duncan. Two. one falls for him. And that's good as he hits both shots. So it's LeBron James making things happen for Miami. He put together 10 points in the quarter. And don't go far. We'll be right back. 12. And 
Close game underway so far. We'll see if either of these teams can jump out ahead in the second quarter. Let's quickly break down what we've seen from the Heat. Well, so far, they've got things rolling along nicely at the offensive end. This is exactly what you want to see if you're a coach. Your team starting fast and playing with confidence. So on the floor for the Spurs. Now Leonard. Here's Parker. Oh, it's no good. That would have tied it. Here's Chalmers. Parker defending. Tries to spin move. Over to the wing. Here's Wade. And the shot goes. If you let Wade get the ball that deep, there really isn't anything you can do. Parker with it. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Here's Ginobili. He's off on that one. And Miami will go the other way with it. Here's Miller to the inside. Pass to Chalmers. Here's Wade. A sweet little floater. And it's a seven-point heat lead. Wade's got a whole bag of tricks for finishing inside. Sometimes the floater is the right fit. Parker outside. Here's Splitter. Tries the nine-footer. And the basket good. A bank shot that time. And here in the second with about a minute and a half gone by. Here's Chalmers. Parker defending. Pass to Wade. Softly drops in the floater. Six points for him. People don't talk enough about the handles of D-Wade. He makes it look easy. Here's Ginobili. Hook loose. Fast break. Here come the Heat. Pass to Bosch. And out of bounds. The Spurs will take it. Both teams will make substitutions. Here's Parker. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. I see you. I see you. Down low. Green with the ball. Here's Diaw. Five to shoot. With the floater. Rebound by the Heat. And we're just over two and a half minutes into the second. Pass to Wade. Another shot. Here's Bosch. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. And let's take a moment to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Heat. Right out of the gate, they've been in attack mode. And I think that's by design because it has been relentless. <laughs> you know, another thing that has impressed me has been their numbers of points in the paint. Just dominating down there. They're just getting whatever shot they want in close. No good on that one. That one misses. San Antonio trailing here. Here's Ginobili. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. The floater. Yep, that one's good. Another thing that makes Tony a tough cover, you try to keep him from the rim, but the floater is really one of his best shots. Here's Wade. Six points for him. Here's the pick. Pass to Bosch. Now Allen. 
Here's Wade. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. You know, he's built like a running back. Wade can bounce off contact. LeBron, he's checked in for Miami. And the Spurs making a change here. Second personal foul. Second team foul. Now at the line, Dwayne Wade. One. There have been seasons where Wade has averaged over 10 free throws a game. He knows how to get to the line. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Pass to Parker. Here's Duncan. Good efficiency. He's drained four out of five. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. Allen against Green. Here's Wade. On the mark with the 15-footer. He's got 11. And Dwayne Wade will do work on you from the mid-range if you let him. And here's Parker. Pass to Diaw. Fires it. And there are the Spurs with another bucket. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Here's Wade. He's got 11. Here's Bosch. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. First personal foul. Third team foul. Now at the line, Chris Bosch. Two. No good on the free throw. So he can't get either to fall. And it's San Antonio's ball. They trail by six. Offensive rebound. Kicks it out to Parker. Pass to Ginobili. 55 seconds left in the first half of this game. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. Here's Wade. Parker defending. James left side. Here's Allen. Let's it go from deep. The rebound by Duncan. 32 seconds left in the second. Ginobili, no good. There's 21 seconds left in the second. Pass to Wade. the basket. He was fouled and he's going to the line for one more. Foul. Tony Parker. First personal foul. Team foul number four. Now at the line Dwayne Wade. One more. And so it's San Antonio with it. Leonard for three. 
smothering defense by LeBron James using his size and quickness to affect the shot. And so it's the Miami Heat closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. Defense is setting the tone. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. This game still to play. Here's Parker. Pass to Duncan. It goes again. His sixth basket in seven tries. The staying power of Tony Parker when it comes to his ability to run an offense. And for the Spurs. Here's Chalmers. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Here's James. And he throws it down. What a terrific lead pass. It's simple. If you get open, LeBron will find you. The king is an incredible passer. And for the Heat. Here's Parker. Gets it to fall from the right block. Parker's gotten his second bucket of the game. And so here is Miami. It's a five-point game. Leonard against James. Over Leonard. Tries again. Bosh, no good. That's the shot you hope for. Right at the rim. Just couldn't capitalize. Here's Parker. Off target at the rim. And the Heat with possession. And we're about a minute and a half in the second half. James inside. Leonard defending. Leonard pulls down the board. Parker outside. Leonard outside. Back to Parker. Six on the shot clock. Makes the most of the high percentage shot. Parker's got four points now in the quarter. A masterful job of running the pick and roll. And of course, Parker makes the right decision. Here's Wade. Green covering. Pass to Bosch. And that one goes. Feeding him with a lead pass. He has six. You just love how reliable he is. Night in and night out, his offense is there. Here's Duncan. He gets it. He's seven for eight and really going at him out there. Assertive move. You can tell the game's heating up a bit. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. Here's Wade. Pass to Bosch. Out to James. They set a pick. There's the triple. And count it. Now five for seven. What confidence from the veteran. LeBron good at realizing when to shoot the three ball. And here's Leonard. Out to the right wing. Here's Parker. Here's Duncan. 16 points for him. Leonard finds Green. Parker outside. Oh, he got hacked on the three-pointer. And he'll head to the line. Always looking for a way to create an opportunity. Parker catches the defender off balance. Ooh, good defensive intensity. But you have to stay in control always. Three shots. And he's good on the first of three. Popovich has done a great job of developing Tony Parker's entire game, and you're seeing it right now at the free throw line. Oh, 
He hits the second from the line. And he can't make it three for three. The Heat with the lead. Third quarter action. Just under three and a half minutes have passed. Haslam, good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Trying to attack the heart of that defense with great teamwork. Outside, Green. Pass to Ginobili. Here's the three. It's hauled in by the Heat. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. This rhythm, it's been way off. The goal now might be to get him something easy at the rim so he can just see the ball go in through the net, and that helps. And the Spurs with possession here. They trail by six. Leonard outside. Pass to Diaw. Parker with it. And he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Parker's got 10 points in the game. And though Parker has stretched his game out to the three-point line, he remains at heart a mid-range shooter. Here's Miller, right wing. Here's Chalmers. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Leonard up top. To the wing, right side. Eighteen feet out, and the shot goes in. Now just a two-point Miami lead. It's a shot we don't see a lot anymore, but Kawhi is an old-school player, still using that mid-range jumper. Now here's Allen. They set the pick to the paint. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. They'll pin that foul on Danny Green. <laughs> so close on the finish. And it could have been a three-point opportunity. <laughs> Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. And the Heat making a change here. James is checked in. And so he's able to get one of two. Two for one opportunity if they can time it right. Great way to end the quarter. Pass to Green. This for the tie! It doesn't go for him. And Miami will go the other way with it. Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Now here's Allen. Here's Haslam. Back to Allen. Here's Chalmers. Fires the three. Out to James. True on the 14-footer. James has got 15 points. Sometimes you have to sit back and enjoy the show. LeBron James is a legend. Appreciate what we are watching. And we've reached the end of the third. Heat out in front. They lead by five. And we're just moments away from the start of quarter number four. Stay with us. It's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. And I know 
I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. So on the floor for San Antonio. Here's Wade. Green covering. James, that's good. LeBron taking over on the offensive end, getting into the teeth of the defense and making a spectacular play. Here's Ginobili. Pass to Green. Here's Duncan. Leonard on the wing. There's the screen. Outside, Green. It's good. And the assist that time from Leonard. In rhythm, what a beautiful release by Danny Green. The catch and shoot, he has it to a science. Here's Wade. Pass to Chalmers. And he converts the layup. And the Heat lead by six. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. And that takes skill and the ability to make adjustments as you're going up. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. Yeah, taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. Here's Duncan. Score that basket. His eighth out of nine shots here today. Zero rim protection. Unforgivable in a tight ball game like this. And I love the play call. This is where you get the ball into the hands of your closers, where they can do something with it. James against Leonard. James outside. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. James has got nine points here in the second half. The acute awareness of LeBron sees the clock running down, doesn't panic. Here's Ginobili. Leonard outside. Inside. And the dunk by Leonard. The vertical of Kawhi is impressive. Rising up with ease and throwing it down. Pass to Chalmers. Now James. Leonard defending. Leonard against James. Here's Chalmers. The rebound by Duncan. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. Pass to Ginobili. Around three minutes gone here in the fourth. Green for three. Here's Duncan. And that's basket number nine for him. He's nine for ten. Activity on the glass. That's a possession that could have gotten away from them. Here's Chalmers. James, right side. Over Leonard. And that one hits the back iron. San Antonio trailing here. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. Here's Ginobili. To take the lead. Green for three. Knocks it down from distance. See, that's money. Important point in this game. Danny Green takes it upon himself. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. Parker, he's checked in for San Antonio. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. Over that last break, I got a chance to hear what Eric Spolstra said to the team. He told his players he expects more from them at the line, saying, quote, keep drawing fouls, keep getting to the strike. But when you do, you got to make it count. Not looking to give those freebies away. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Allie. So it's Miami now. Here's Wade. Over Green. Wade misses. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Pass to Parker. 
Now Green. Shot clock at six. Leonard against James. Leonard, good. Knowing the situation, Kawhi willing and able to take control. Big bucket. Here's Wade. Green covering to stop the run. Bosch. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. It's the fourth quarter, and it's a close game. You want to get the ball to someone you can rely on. Oh, what ferocity on the throwdown. I just love when he goes up with purpose. Where was the D right there? The effort lacking big time. In a close game like this, everything has to be challenged, and everything has to be earned. Pass to Bosch. Here's Chalmers. There's a screen. The putback. And here are the Spurs now. They're on a 16-6 run. Parker finds Leonard. Parker against James. To the middle. There is absolutely no fear in his eyes. He loves the moment. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. And now we've got an intentional foul. Second foul. First team foul. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Third person foul. Back line for the Spurs. Tony Parker. Two. So the first one drops, and that'll put him up two. So he drops them both, and it's a three-point game. That's why you want him at the line when the game is close. He knows how to deliver in the clutch. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. They trail by three. 26 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Wade, green covering. Wade misses, and they foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Yeah, just trying to keep this game alive. Not a bad foul right there. Shooting for San Antonio. Team two. Gives him a four-point cushion. So he goes two for two at the line. And it's a five-point game. Tremendous showing of confidence by getting those two to fall. First clean look they have. I mean, they've got to take it. And even if they make it, they need an immediate foul no matter who catches the ball. And an intentional foul right there. First foul. First personal foul. Team foul number four. At the line for the Spurs. Danny Green. Two.
He gets the first, and that increases the lead to six. A prototype 3 and D guy. Green's focused on becoming a more complete player. Part of that is becoming more consistent from the free throw line. And a tough break as his second attempt is no good at the line. Here's Wade. Off on that one. So we see the Spurs get the win here. And they barely squeezed out the win here on the road. And B.A., the visiting team is always under some added pressure. But they made it work and got the win, whatever the margin may have been. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Steve Smith, this is Brian Anderson with our 2K Sports crew signing off. Now let's check our New Balance player of the game.